guys, the Blood Lover channel here with another video. Yes, I know I haven't uploaded a video on this channel for a while except my Avengers Endgame trailer reaction, which nobody saw, but it's still up on the channel if you want to watch it. With the lack of videos because I've been busy with work, Christmas shopping, and also dealing with a little bit of a virus, very sick the last couple of days. So I apologize for the wait. December is almost over. Christmas is just a, literally six days away. So yeah guys, so right now you're tuned in to the Die Hard 30th Anniversary Blu-ray edition with that cool new Christmas slip cover. So right here I'm also wearing my uh, Yoda Christmas shirt, which is great. And this is the 30th Anniversary Edition of Die Hard. Even though I have the standard Blu-ray Die Hard edition right here, I also have that cool two disc DVD uh, they released years ago. I picked that up, it's in my closet somewhere, stored all my old DVDs. I wanted to pick up this edition of Die Hard 30th Anniversary Edition. There's a cool slipcover right here. And um, you turn the back, look at this. This is awesome. It's just, but I love it how they have like the Roy and they have the New York badge and, you know, helicopters, Yippee Kaye, Yippee Kaye, and the helicopters are here and the money signs Die Hard. Police cars, ho, ho, ho. And it's great. And, um, here you get just uh, John McClane, a.k.a. Bruce Willis, with his gun, Nakatomi Plaza, the background here, with all the credits and the special features, which basically are in this Die Hard special features, but I wish they would take all the special features from the Die Hard DVD to the set and put it in here. I don't know why they don't do that. And the front, and like I showed you, I'm going to open it up. Here is the digital code, which I'll be keeping or giving it to a family member. And then this edition actually comes with these really cool Die Hard Christmas cards. And I'm going to take out the uh, cool band here and uh, show you these Christmas cards right now. How nice that looks, right? Die Hard 30th Anniversary Edition. Then there's this one cool with John McClane on a Christmas ornament going through the glass of Nakatomi. Next up is Hans Gruber, a.k.a. Alan Rickman, the late, great Alan Rickman, who created one of the best villains of all time, ever be duplicated as a um, villain. Everybody's tried to be a um, Hans Gruber, but you can't because there's only one, and that was Alan Rickman. Rest in peace. And the last one is yippee ki -yay, Merry Christmas with the Nakatomi symbol, which is so cool. Birds are great with the 30th anniversary Die Hard Blu-ray edition. I'm not actually going to give those away to anybody. The thing you get inside, you don't get no inside artwork, the recycling logo, I don't know why, it's probably been done with recycled plastic. Here is the Blu-ray disc, just looking blue. I would have thought they would have, you know, you know, te technically like taken the artwork from the um, slipcover on the Blu-ray and make it look so nice, but they cannot do that for some reason. And also I read online a few, like a week ago, that 62% of Americans think that Die Hard is not a Christmas movie and just thinks it's just a regular action movie. And the other percentage of people think it is a Die Hard movie. And I'm thinking to myself, wow, if you people don't think Die Hard's a Christmas movie, I'm going to bust you in the mouth. Because we, I had a debate video on that and I'm going to leave it at the end of this video to see why people should know that Die Hard is a Christmas movie and even Bruce Willis said that Die Hard wasn't a Christmas movie during his celebrity roast. Die Hard is a Christmas movie. John McClane goes on vacation to Los Angeles to see his estranged wife Holly McClane on Christmas Eve. Goes there sees his, to see his wife and they're having a Christmas party in Nakatomi after celebrating a big you know deal and then Hans Gruber and his merry men come in to spoil the Christmas party. John McClane jumps into action on Christmas Eve Messing shit up, driving everybody crazy, making Hans Gruber, driving his henchmen crazy. And if you've seen Die Hard, if it's based on Christmas Eve, and it's all through that as an action movie, and they have Christmas references and Christmas music, and at the end it has the joy, the Christmas, the theme, and everything, and it says Merry Christmas. Looking forward to McLean with Bruce Willis, a younger John McLean, a younger Holly McLean, as I heard on the news a few days ago, so I can't wait for that. Bruce Willis will be returning in a bigger role in that, so it's going to go back and forth. 
But yeah, guys, Die Hard is a Christmas movie, and if you think it's not, come on, man. Get your head out of your ass. 1988 masterpiece by John McTiernan, starring Bruce Willis, which made him a star. With a great villain played by the late, great Alan Rickman as Hans Gruber. Die Hard is a Christmas movie. So, with that, leave me your comments down below and let me know if you picked up the 30th anniversary edition of the Blu-ray with the cool slip cover, Christmas slip cover of Die Hard 30th anniversary edition. Leave that comment and let me know what is your favorite part of Die Hard and keep the debate going that Die Hard is a Christmas movie. And what do you think about 62% of Americans don't think Die Hard is a Christmas movie? Leave that comments down below. Give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the Rural Lover channel. And try to get me to 1,000 subscribers in 2018. Currently right now at uh, 918, but I got almost there. So it almost works. By 2019, I should be up to 1,000. So subscribe if you're not. Share the video and hit my post notifications. And once you hit my bell, you will get all my new videos uploaded into your inboxes. So hit that bell. And with that, I want to wish all my subscribers and non-subscribers a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. If anniversary, Blu-ray edition unboxing. All right, guys, later.